Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to change your cable modem and router DNS. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do these changes and I'm going for the purpose of this video I'm going to use Quad9 or you can use either either one uh Cloudflare which this one I like both of them. So this is Quad9 then so in order for you to do that you need to go into your cable modem or router so I'm already logged in here that's already see you gotta go to advanced gotta go to advanced right here then then set up then internet setup then go to right about here the main server DNS address get automatically from ISP it will give you automatically from ISP so I don't want to use my ISP uh, DNS so I'm using quad 9 which is 9.9.9.9 .9 and you can find it here as well it tells you how to for individual so okay right here it tells you how, uh, how to set it up on a windows computer quad 9 is free security solution that uses dns to protect your system blah 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 so this one it is it tell you the step uh, step one Step two. Step three. Select just the following DNS service address and enter 9.9.9 into the preferred DNS server box for the alternative DNS servers. Enter one. So that's what already I'm going to show you how to do that on your uh, cable modem or router some of the uh, cable modem and router they have primary secondary and tertiary uh, DNS so on the primary and secondary you can use whatever you want if you want to use Cloudflare you can use Cloudflare here here are the instruction of our Cloudflare as well the iPhone, Android, Mac OS, Windows, Linux, and router. So I like both of these uh, DNS providers. They're, they're very good, very reliable. I haven't used Cloudflare, but I can use this as a, my backup on my, I use this Cloudflare on my router and then Quad9 on my modem. So let's go to Quad9, see okay in order for that to work on your on your router step four is giving you the step four okay uh, and then i go into my router this is my modem so right there once you're done you click apply then that's it and your cable your cable model is going to reboot after the changes simple and easy so you just the address for uh, quad 9 is www quad9.net slash home slash individual so that's where you go to uh, for the uh, quad9 DNS it's pretty easy and simple it's straightforward There's, you can you can't go wrong on this one so this is what I did it it's on the Netgear C7000 Check something here. See, even here, it's right here. Mm 
domain server now. that's my I got three DNS so I'm gonna go to security and then administration I'm gonna check the log I always check the log on my cable modem here see oh my god to clear the log Event log as well. Got to clean that log. Always, if you stream any uh, uh, any app other than uh, Netflix and Hulu or Amazon Prime, I really suggest you to change your DNS so you can use your own DNS on your cable modem already and. Since I did this, I've been using it for like about a year, and I get buffered very, very minimal or nothing at all sometimes. But you have to change your DNS uh, on your cable modem, or you can change it on your uh, streaming device as well. Uh, I will bring you how to uh, another video how to change it on your uh, streaming device. But at this point here, I'm just showing you how to do it on the on your cable modem and router. It is it's the same procedure that you use. And I use like I use uh, streaming uh, apps as well, like TTV, uh, Cyberflix. Uh, what else? Uh, Sion, T uh, Sion TV. And I have no issues at all. And plus, on top of that, I use uh, Guard DNS. Well, uh, wait, let me see what it's called. It's called AdGuard Blocker on my uh, Fire Stick and other devices that I have. And I'm always running on a VPN 24/7. I mean, I get a, a decent speed, but it's all good, you know. I don't really mind getting my speed. Uh, slower a little bit but I just want to use uh, VPN like I said and always always reboot your uh, your uh, your internet gears like cable modem router and streaming device computer if you if you stream a lot so see this is this is the procedure on on Cloudflare too you can use Cloudflare if you want the uh, website for Cloudflare, Cloudflare is https column forward slash forward slash that one one that one that one that one slash dns so see here is the website and explain you everything this the purpose of this video is to show you how to change your dns which you know is on a Netgear router, I mean routered and modem, you go to, first of all you go to here, basic, you gotta go to advanced, setup, and internet, right there, those are Quad9 DNS, of course Quad9 has DNS for, uh, let me see, if you are using IPv6 uh, select internet protocol okay so they I'm pretty sure they must have IPv6 yeah right here see it right there IPv6 enter this you can use that in your cable modem but I'm not sure if some of the uh, ISP provided are uh, using the IPv6 okay so this is the procedure here step four and blah 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 you can watch the video too and it will walk through it and this is where uh, uh, quad 9 is uh, it's located at they're located here in California so yep see this so that's all you need to know and as well I'm using uh, Adgar as well so 
Yep, I always use uh, Adgar on my streaming devices, and I it's been working so good, no no issues at all. So, if you have any question about it, just please let me know in the comment below. I will be more than happy to help you out if I can. And if you like the video, please hit the like button, like, share, and subscribe, please. I'm trying to grow my channel and bring as much as as, as much as content I can, but uh, I will be doing that more often. Like you know, I've been busy at work, but now work has been slowed down. So today is my my video that I'm doing about DNS. Thank you for watching.